And we welcome you back to the Death Star here at Microsoft's Wrigley Field. Book shall be back for another great season of baseball. Obviously, the big question as we enter this year is can anyone break Frankenberry's record of 326 home runs last season? As always, I welcome back my partner in the booth, R2-D2. And R2, how about the robot from Lost in Space last season? 9,027 RBI. 9,027 robots batted in. So set to go on the mound for the Mets today, the Coke machine. The big guy's been throwing the ball extremely well. A steady diet of Cokes. He'll mix in the occasional Sprite to keep the batters off balance. And then just when he feels like they're getting locked in on him, he'll mix in the occasional tab. Got an excellent, excellent defense behind him. Kit from Knight Rider out there patrolling center field. He can downshift, cover a lot of ground. Well, up first. For the Astros, it will be the $6 million man as Austin digs in on the right side. Bigger, better, stronger, faster, but still a crappy on-base percentage. Coke Machine looks in, has the sign, puts 75 cents in himself, pushes the button, and the pitch. And that ball's outside. It's one and nothing to the $6 million man. A season ago, Steve Austin, a tremendous year. He was second in the league to Frankenberry with 300 home runs, 26 behind the league leader. Coke machine ready to work, and here's the 1-0. The $6 million man swings and hits a ground ball into the hole at short. C-3PO to his right. Backhand stab, nice play. Throw on to first, the stretch by the Terminator, and they got him. Nice play by C-3PO. He's not only gold, he's a gold glover. And we're expecting a lot out of C-3PO this season, R2. He spent half the year last year on the DL due to rust. And you know what that's like, don't you, buddy? Darth Vader doesn't like the call. And he's coming out of the dugout. He's going to go over there and argue with Cowboy Joe West. R2, I tell you what, it's a scary sight anytime you see Darth Vader with the lightsaber out. And here he goes, approaching Joe West. Oh, and Darth Vader has sliced first base umpire Joe West in half. Well, that'll set the umpire and crew straight. Nonetheless, the $6 million <laughs> man is out. And up next for the Astros, it'll be Iona from Richie Rich. So Iona digs in left side. She's a switch hitter, if you know what I mean. And the first pitch on the way from the Coke machine. That one in there for a knee-high strike, and it's nothing in one. Coke machine usually works with a pretty steady pace. He's got the quarters ready. Puts them in himself, pushes the button, and a sprite on the way. Iona with a swing. That one drilled deep. Right field. Optimus Prime going back, turning, looking. Gone! Iona has left the lot, and the Astros are on the board. They lead it one to nothing. Iona circling the bases, taking her time as she pimps out her trot, and this could end up sparking some trouble between these two teams. Boog Shabby, R2-D2, back here at Microsoft's Wrigley Field as we go to the last of the fourth, and the Mets lead this game 4-1. to one. Mets up to hit as they'll face the crafty veteran, the Shasta machine on the hill. Mets got the lead in the third. Inspector Gadget with a grand slam. R2, interesting play as Gadget speeding around the bases with the aid of his helicopter hat, got to third. Rosie's waiting there with the baseball. Gadget flashes her, and he's able to score as she collapsed from shock. Now, one of the things interesting, that play originally ruled a triple and an error. As Shasta looks in for the side, has it, puts a dime in himself, Terminator waiting, and the pitch. And that's right there for a strike, and it's nothing in one <laughs> to the Terminator. Now back to that play, R2. You actually went down and talked to our official scorer, Joshua, from the movie War Games, and he was, shall we say, unhappy with your inquiry and the change of scoring. Originally a triple and an error, then shifted to a grand slam. I'm with you, thought it was a triple, and then the error. But you made your inquiry, and Joshua got a little testy, didn't he? After you made the inquiry, he said, how about a game of global thermonuclear war? And there's a ball outside of the Terminator. Count even up one and one. The Shasta machine featuring a variety of pitches, mainly off speed. The cream soda, the black cherry, and of course, even when you know it's coming, so difficult to hit the fresco. The money in the machine and the pitch. 
And Terminator swings and pops him up. And back of first, there's RoboCop going back, and he's going to call off the mechanical giant evil spider thing from Wild Wild West. Steps around the torso of Joe West. And he dropped it. He dropped the ball, and Terminator cruises into second. It's a two-base error on RoboCop. Oh, R2, we've seen it a thousand times. Some shaky defense from RoboCop. Back off, or there will be trouble. And now RoboCop has just shot the torso of Joe West. R2, that is just flat-out frustration. That's all it is. So Shasta on the hill, and he'll stare in at the next hitter, the speedster kick. Night Rider, a shadowy flight into the dangerous world of a man who does not exist. Hit with his fancy computer crowding that plate and the first offering from Shasta. Look out! Almost hit him! Oh, R2, some bumper music at Kit. And Shasta <laughs> clearly not playing around. So one and nothing to Kit as the Mets lead 4-1. Terminator out there at second. In the outfield left to right, the crappy murderous robots of iRobot. <laughs> Tell you what, R2, Will Smith really should be proud of that fine piece of work, huh? And the next offering from the crafty Southpaw Shasta machine. Oh, he hit him. He hit him in the windshield, cracked the windshield. i tell you what, that is absolutely going to run more than the $500 deductible for Kid, as he will take his base. Two on, nobody out. And here comes C-3PO up to the dish. And R2, you love this song, don't you? Mets on top 4-1, and C-3PO climbs in right side. On the left side of the infield for the Astros, Tron backed up at short. Johnny 5, the same over there at third. Two on, nobody out, and Shasta's first offering to C-3PO. Misses down and away for ball one. C-3PO already with a brilliant defensive play in this one as the Mets try to blow it open. And the next one. Swing and a drive. Left center field. There's nobody out there. That's going to roll all the way to the fence. Terminator towards third. They're going to wave him in. Here's Kit towards third. They're going to send him. Here's the throw. Relay to the play. And Kit over. The $6 million man flat out ran him over. And the $6 million man is down. Oh, the humanity. The $6 million man is not getting up. And Kit just left tire marks on him. Oh, and in the crowd, Oscar Goldman is weeping, and they are going to have to find some investors to help put the $6 million man back together.